Good morning, everyone, and welcome back to some more Harvest Stella. We've got a search for Tyella in the Heaven's Egg, but first we have quite a few crops to collect, so let's do that. We've got some more cucumbers. Uh, there is a quest I want to do in Nemea, or at least start it and see what it's all about. So we'll do that as well. Um, I've been told I actually don't need to water my uh, my tree, so Fireworks I'm not going to. Um, which I, yeah, I didn't really realize. But anyway, we've got some more flour. Um, the tomatoes over here aren't ready yet, I think. Yeah, nothing else is ready. Okay, so last time a bunch of stuff happened. We met Istina, who was uh, the shadow assassin, who I'm hoping will help us out in the Heaven's Egg when we return, and we will return today. That is uh, pretty much my main plan, but um, for now, do I want to sell anything? My inventory is so freaking full right now. Um, so let's not, let's put some stuff away first. Quickly do this. Okay, put all my shit away, and now I think I'm just gonna pop some more wheat in the flour, uh, flour mill. Here we go, and uh, it will pop in. Oh, wow, we could put firelight fruit in here. Oh, I kind of want to do that. <laughs> I kind of want to do that, even though it's it's also a bomb ingredient. We can put... Wow, we can make a drink out of it. Okay, let's do it. Let's do it. Speaking of bombs, maybe I should go make another one. Um, I don't think I've got any on me right now, do I? So let's go make a quick bomb. <laughs> and also just quickly check and see what I can cook, too. So, yeah, we can make a bomb. Let's do that. 20 minutes. Bing, bang, bosh. Uh, I don't think I'm going to do any food delivery today. But I will just see what we can cook. And yeah, apparently fences are just really good for, yeah, organizing your um, fields if you want to. I'm probably not going to focus on that for now. Because uh, I'm a little bit lazy. When it comes to things that are purely aesthetic in games like this, I'm kind of lazy. Uh, unless they do serve some sort of other purpose, I don't know, but for now, not gonna bother. I've got a repair kit on me, I've got a return bell. I think that should do for now. Right, let's see what we can cook quickly, and we'll be on our way! Back to Namiya. I could make a ketchup omelette. Ooh, but I could make a hamburger now. Ooh, should I do that? We haven't delivered that yet, have we? You know what? We're going to do it. We're going to use up one of my eggs and all of my mushrooms, but that's okay. I think we'll uh, we'll do that. That should get us a good chunk of money, I'm hoping. Alright. But yeah, I'm, I'm not going to sell the tomatoes and things that I just harvested because they're probably not... They're probably more useful in recipes, so... Yeah, let's uh, quickly nip back to the village. See what we can sell. Oh, you nearly, you nearly, oh, I nearly forgot. I nearly done forget. Got water in my straw buddies. My little buddies are thirsty. Got to give them a nice little drink. There we go. Nearly forgot about them. Holy crud. And everything else. So yeah, apparently I don't need to worry about watering my tree for some reason. I don't know why that is. But anyway, get the tomatoes watered, the cucumbers, which have been very productive. And uh, yeah, the straw buddies are going to be reharvestable as well. So hopefully we'll get a couple of those uh, in before the end of the, uh, the season. And yeah, all right, back to the village. Let's go, bye go, bye. go. Bye bye. Oh, man. <laughs> right, let's deliver food to the inn, and I, I'm thinking of buying some more recipes and a mount. I think a mount would be a good idea overall just to save me some time. Um, so we'll see if we have enough for that in a moment. There we go, hamburger and egg. <laughs> 2,000 Griller, and a- oh, we can make tackles. Oh my god, we can make tackles? Wow. Okay. Alright. My sister freaking loves tacos. Uh, not bad, you've already brought three meals. You've been a great help, thanks, keep it up. I will try my best. Da -da 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 -da. I bet there's other quests in this village as well. There's at least two more that we can do because of the uh, fairy order thing. 
No idea where they are, though. So, let's, um... Let's quickly nip to the adorable frickin' Conaloo merchant. And see if we can buy ourselves a mount, because we've got a little bit of money now. Oh, are you kidding me? Still a little bit short. Still a little bit short. Okay. Well... Oh my god! Yeah, we'll, uh, we'll be back, we will be back, but let's head to Namiya, and yeah, I'm pretty sure there's a quest. So we'll get that started, and if we have time, we will return to Heaven's Egg, because we've got to, we've got to beat up that plant again, but I'm guessing we're going to have a little bit of help this time from a certain Shadow Assassin. And then I'm guessing we'll learn that job for ourselves as well, which sounds wonderful, because it looks like it dual wields swords, which is pretty epic. I do like a good dual wielding uh, class. Even though, to be fair, I don't often use them. I don't use them very often, but they're, they're very cool. They are awesome. Right. Pretty sure the quest dude was over here, was he not? That does look, that does sound like Seinfeld, doesn't it? Here he is. Oh, you got a bit of a bit of a cold there, young man. Oh, I can't stop sneezing. At this rate, I'll. Oh god, yeah. You know what? I have a really weird thing. I have sneezing fits whenever I'm finished with a meal and I'm scraping like the rest of the food in the bin or putting my plate away or washing my plate. I don't know why. It happens so often that even my mum, when she hears me do it, will laugh. Because it's just... I don't know why my body decides to do it. It's so weird. On cue every time. Uh, are you okay? Oh, this music's so jolly, isn't it? No, I'm not okay! The sneezing is getting out of hand! Or out of nose, more appropriately. Hey, you, young man. Young man, what are you doing out here? You better go home quick. Uh, y yeah, I guess you're right. Okay, this was abrupt. Hurry and say, uh, stay home till your sneezing calms down. Okay, he just doesn't want him spreading anything, which is understandable, especially considering recent real-world events. Uh, okay, okay, well then, see ya. Alright, um, wasn't... Isn't that, isn't it just a, a cold? I mean, don't un underestimate colds. Colds freaking suck. Uh, wasn't he overdoing it a bit? You're not from Namiya, are you? I suppose you wouldn't know. Recently, people keep getting abducted around here. Weirdly enough, it's only people who sneeze that get taken away. What? I thought it was just young girls. Oh, okay, you're gonna have to explain this. Doesn't matter if the men, women, kids, or seniors. Anyone can get taken. Or maybe this is something completely unrelated to the whole monster thing. They do all come back after a while. They come back? Okay... Somehow, they don't remember a thing about being abducted. Gives you the creeps, doesn't it? Only people who sneeze. This is weird. All we know is it's only people who sneeze that get taken away. You should be careful too, buddy. If you start sneezing, you better hide away in an inn or, or leave town. Well, thanks for the very odd warning. Hope that guy made it back home alright. If you wouldn't mind, could you check uh, he made it home, just in case? I don't want to catch anything. I have to get back to work. You see, we're real busy at the moment. What do you do for a living? I might run into the culprit on the way. I'm busy too, you know. <laughs> I mean, I am actually. Um, trying to save the world and all that. I might run into the culprit on the way. I'm going to see if we uh, what happens if we say this. Oh, yeah, you'll be fine though, right? Or do you mean you want to catch the bad guy? Either way, it's up to you now. Oh, thanks. The sneezing guy went that way, across the bridge, then he turned left. Hidden Doctor's Expedition? I I'm really excited to see. E e the, the two quests we've done so far have been really, really good. Like, I was invested in the story, so I'm really curious to see what the heck's going on with this. Only people who sneeze. Follow the sneezing boy in Namiya. Okay, well, I 
guess... You know what? Today is just quest day. I don't think we're going to get back to the Heaven's Egg after all. I'm sure Tyel will be fine. Uh-oh. I'm not sure this guy's going to be fine. Oh my, excuse me. You you, you there? Are you all right? Um... Uh, mm. You the sneezing guy! Do you know this boy? Uh, very briefly. Ah, well, it looks like he lost his consciousness for a while. Apart from that, he looks alright. Yeah, just fell unconscious as you do. Nothing wrong with that. Um, he must have gotten really scared and fainted, poor boy. Who could have scared him so badly? I just happened to be passing by, so I don't know for sure. You see, a big shadowy figure came and tried to take him away. Oh! Okay, maybe you should have mentioned that, like, from the beginning. <laughs> but I screamed and that made it panic, and then it left the boy and ran away. That's very odd. I've heard of people getting abducted. Yeah, there seems to be two different abductions going on here, and that's a lot of abductions for a small town. <laughs> uh, could that figure have been the culprit? So you've heard about the sneezing incidents then? That must have been the culprit. Yeah. Did you see what it looked like? Probably not. If you're just if you describing it as a shadowy figure. To be honest, I was kind of panicking too. It was all a blur to me. It didn't look human though, and it looked like it was wearing some kind of black armor. Could it have been an omen? Black armor? Yeah, maybe it was an omen. Maybe it was a monster playing human. Ooh, I kind of want to say that one, even though I think the top one is probably more likely... Uh, although, who knows? Who knows? I'm gonna go for this one. I don't think so. It was... Ah, I know. That was no doubt one of those omens. Yeah, I know. I was just trying to lighten the mood. Why would omens want to abduct people? Why do they do anything they do? We don't really know much about them still. I have no idea. I saw it run off towards the North Step. Uh, are you going after them? Well, I guess I am now. Alright, I'll stay here with this boy. Yeah, look, you look after him. Maybe give him a pillow. He's just, he's face planting the, the stone right there. Once he wakes up, uh, I'll make sure he gets home. Don't get yourself into too much danger, okay? If you get in trouble, just run away. Stay safe. Yeah, I might have to, depending on how tough it is. Right, to the north step we go. Also... If I am going back there, I might need a little bit of energy. Uh, I'll eat my last straw, buddy. Right. I always forget the layout of this town. Where, where is the where is the entrance again? Oh, okay, 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 okay. There it is, right. Yeah, let's go to the North Step. We might as well see see how far we can get through this quest today. And that's, that's what I'm really enjoying about this as well, is while there is a pressing story to follow, we don't need to. We can we can take a bit of a break from it if we need. And, you know, it doesn't really make sense because Tyler would totally be plant food right now. Or, well, I think she's linked with the monsters. She must, she must have some sort of connection to them. Right, where are we headed? Um... Looks like not too far. Ah, we're going to be running past a fear monster, though, which is a bit worrying. Still haven't fought any of those yet, of course, but that will happen one day. Maybe not just right now. Although, might as well kill these things on the way, because that's some XP. And, oh yeah, Asl isn't with us anymore, is he? Unless we're in the Heaven's Egg, he doesn't bother coming with us. What a lazy bastard. How... Frickin' rude. Okay, a bunch of leaves. I wonder if Cress is gonna send for another uh, bunch of items soon. Do, do, do. Yeah, suck it. Have a crescent slash. Crescent slash. Bosh. Might swap back to the uh, air lancer. For a little bit, maybe. Right. Yeah, I don't... 
know if I really want to fight that, because it's going to be like level 20 something, isn't it? That thing is terrifying. Yeah, it's let's curious. avoid it. It'll let's slip past it. Here we go. We get a nice little chest too. More copper ore. I really need to go see if I can upgrade more weapons. Uh, then again, I don't really have the money. I'm trying to save up. What is this guy doing? Excuse me, sir. Have you been abducting people? Oh, you are an omen. All I need now is that last... That one last ingredient and it will be complete. Hopefully, it'll work to reduce the symptoms. Now, I did... Just judging by the name of the quest, I did suspect that there would be a doctor involved. Huh? Who are you? Oh, an Abel. What do you want? Yeah, I'm about to throw down. If, you, if you've been abducting people and getting up to no good, um, I'm afraid you're going to eat, eat steel or whatever my weapon's made of. Well, when you put it that way, sure. But no, I'm not abducting them. I can explain. It's not my intention to fight with you. I bet he's abducting them, well, temporarily to fix them up. If they're ill, because they're sneezing, he's concerned about them. Hear me out. Explain yourself, then. My name is Regia? Probably saying that wrong. My goal is to stop the spread of a disease which is rampaging through Nemea. I'm collecting cell samples from the Abels of Nemea for my research, that's all. Well, that's jolly noble of you. What kind of cell samples? I'm researching a disease called hay fever. Oh my god. Okay, I thought it was going to be something super serious. Like a plague or something. It's hay... I mean, hay fever sucks. Although, I've luckily, I've never suffered from it. So I can't really say. But I have family members that get it really bad. I know it can be incredibly debilitating. So I'm, I'm not trying to make light of hay fever. But I just didn't expect it to be something so common. If you were in Nemea, you must have uh, seen the Abel sneezing too. That is a symptom of hay fever. When tiny particles from flowers spread and enter the body, they cause a flare-up of hay fever. The symptoms are hard to manage, ranging from sneezing to itchy eyes, headaches and fatigue. In severe cases, the afflicted can develop low vision and have difficulty breathing. How do you treat it? No treatment cur currently exists, hence my urgent research. To make it clear, I mean no harm to the Abels of Nemea. Capturing them is the only way I am able to perform my research and find a cure for hay fever. So you absolutely are abducting them, but just temporarily. You're kind of borrowing them. Uh, it's scaring the people of Nemea. I mean, I understand why he hasn't, like, openly just approached them, because they are obviously... If they're anything like the, the villagers of Leith, they're probably super wary of these omens, because, well, they do seem quite scary, or at least most of them. They will have to deal with it until a cure is found. If you want to speed up the process, do you need some materials? You can cooperate in my research. You walk weird. Um, I should be able to complete the cure much faster with your help. And you'll restore peace for the Abels quicker too. Everybody wins. What do you say? Will you cooperate? Absolutely. What do you need me to do? Wise choice. Well then, we have no time to lose. I need you to get a certain ingredient for me. It's called an... A antihistamine! Okay, you can get it from a monster called Bloom that li oh, lives in the heavens, Egg. Well, actually, I'm glad I came to do this quest then, because that is exactly where I'm heading. I'm pretty sure I've probably killed a few of them anyway, haven't I? That's probably just the, the plant things? I'm not too sure. Uh, we will investigate, though. I will be waiting. Okay, I will try my best. Uh, it's 3pm, though. We need five... Defeat five Blooms. Okay, that shouldn't be too tough. Um, it's probably a lot tougher sneaking past this thing. Go, go, go. Do, do, do. Okay, so back to, yeah. Probably have a little bit of time. Yeah, because I, I imagine the next thing we'll be doing is the is the plant boss again. I'm 
sure there'll be, uh, you know, there'll, there'll be time to do some killing of balloons as well. So we'll just head straight over there. Although I am, I am running a little bit low on food, I must admit. I feel like I do, I probably should do some more cooking. Also, looks like I have enough job points to learn... Step. Yes, please. Uh, I think I'll go for Wind Nail 2 next. That's going to need 600 bloody hell. Yeah, okay. Oh, and looks like my mage is ready as well. Enhance normal attack, or should I get... Uh, Electro 2. Hmm. We'll get Electro 2. Right, here we go. I love this soundtrack. It's so good. Oh! Asshole, hold up, hold up a second. Yeah, I mean, he's he's probably desperate to find Tyella. He's like, where have you guys been? Don't try to stop me, Arya. There isn't a moment to lose. I have to get Tyella out of here. But the, that regenerating monster's still in there, remember? All the more reason why we can't sit around doing nothing. I'm sure Estina's gonna come to our aid. Don't you worry. Just cool it a second. How can I? Aha, I wonder who this could be. We just need to kill the one regenerating monster, right? God, she she is quite the woman. Uh, easy, show me the way, please. Estina. So you're finally admitting you're the Shadow Assassin? Am I, though? Uh, you totally are. You totally are. I've seen what you can do. I could just be keeping you on your toes and be no use to you whatsoever. Why on earth would you do that? The Shadow Assassin is just an old gossip anyway, right? No. Good grief. Good grief indeed. Thank you. Yeah, I can read between the lines. I'm not here for you, I feel thanks. I'm here because I want to be. I feel like I should give her a really badass voice, but I just can't... I, I can barely do, like, a range of male voices, never mind. <laughs> I have no range whatsoever. Um, I'm here because I want to be. But I know keeping my mouth shut won't uh, please any of you, so I'll tell you this. I mean it when I say I don't want to use my ability. Even now I can feel my hands shaking. Yeah, I don't know if that voice suits her. Uh, until we hear her actually speak properly, I, I have no idea. If these shaking hands are able to save one life... Estina. I won't pretend to know your circumstances, but I'm grateful for your help. And I'm sorry for being so pushy and awful earlier. Earlier. But don't worry, I understand you need to get a reaction out of me. You needed to get a reaction. Don't think anything of it. Thank you for understand. Yeah, thanks. With that out of the way, I think it's about time uh, for round two. Let's do this. Yeah, Arya. And she joined the party. So now I'm going to have to make a choice, aren't I? And, and I don't think there really is a choice. Estina is joining us. And I think she's probably going to replace Arya for now. <clears throat> okay. And we awa uh, awaken heightened powers again. We can now become a shadow war. Oh. So I'm not a Shadow Assassin, Shadow Walker. That's almost just as badass. Uh, a job with great physical power, it deals a lot of damage to enemies weak to break and other status abnormalities. <sighs> yeah, that sounds pretty tasty. We seem to be unlocking jobs very quickly, by the way. Like, we're unlocking more jobs before I've even really gotten used to the other ones. Right, let's... um. Get to the outer stairway. Of course, we'll have to equip the job before we can use it. And also, let me just check. Oh, okay. Asl and Estina aren't actually with us. Huh. 
I can remove it from my party, though. Oh, I can choose now. Okay, yeah, let's get Asl in. Right, gotcha. Estina. That is a pretty badass looking looking party right there. Sorry, Arya, you're going to sit this one out. Uh, and since we've already got Sky Lancer and Shadow Walker, I'm probably going to go back to Mage or uh, Fighter for this one. But um, I really do need to eat something. Uh, preferably something with some stamina, so should I eat this vegetable salad? Mm, we'll save that for now. We'll have some we'll have some berry juice. We'll eat the salad when we get a little bit lower on energy. And I think, yeah, we'll go back to Fighter for I now. I didn't think I would have to resort to using this technique again. Okay, I'm guessing that's how she sounds. Alright. Yeah, I can't I can't emulate that. I'm not a voice actor. Round two. There it is, the monster in question. I can't see its weak spot yet. You'll need to weaken it first. Okay. So basically, we just need to kill it again. Easily done. It wasn't too tough last time. Let's go. Yeah! Of course, only three of us are going to fight it at once. That's fine. Ouch. Poisoned already. Good start. Not really. Ooh, there's the break. So hopefully Estina should do way more damage to it now. Which does seem to be the case. We plow into it. Okay, health-wise. Don't need to eat anything just yet. Skill hasn't popped again yet. It's nearly done anyway. It's nearly done. Oh, you know what? Yeah, just to be safe. Stop poisoning me, dude. Alright, no problem. Estina, do your thing. I have no idea what its weak point would be. It's it's got quite a few areas that look like they might be. It's regenerating. Estina. I see it. Look at that. One slice. You did it. That was amazing, Estina. I'm impressed. I'm just glad I didn't, uh, I, I'm just glad I haven't lost my touch. You really earned that title. Assassins are so cool, they're so awesome. Assassins are so awesome, dude. There's no need for praise. It won't make me feel any better. Okay, alright. Debbie Downer. I was forced to learn how to kill. Oh, I was forced to learn how to kill people since I was able to walk. That's messed up. That's messed up using this ability now just made me realize that the only thing I know how to do right is, is, is no oh my god I can't talk the only thing I know how to do right is destroy life no you're pretty good at raising kids too running an orphanage Estina that's not true you raised me back at the orphanage and you're a wonder with the kids oh she raised you how old is is, is, is Estina do we think I mean she must be Oh, maybe, maybe like 35, 40, something like that. Your past does not define your identity. You can do so much more than kill. You can re you can hurt things really bad too. <laughs> I'll kick anyone's ass who tries to tell you otherwise. Is this the first time we've seen this game use a bad word? It might be. Oh, asshole. It's just like you said, Estina. The Shadow Assassin is nothing more than baseless gossip. You are you, not some fable in a book. You're a teacher at an orphanage, uh, who just happens to have a killer arm. Huh. You grew up to be a fine young man. Now this isn't the place to stand around chatting, we need to start looking for Tayala. Yeah, probably should do that. You're right. Scary plant. 
completely, absolutely destroyed. At least that's out of the way, huh? Something on your mind? <laughs> so the assassin was really just a rumor? I've got to, I've got to go for these stupid dialogue options. I can't not do now. Do try to keep up, won't you? Come on, we should follow them. All right. How much time do we have? Do we have left? Okay, we still got a good chunk of time. I reckon. I reckon we can press on a little bit. There's nothing here we've missed, is there? No. To the next zone. See if we can find any of these blooms. I'm guessing they're just some of the regular enemies. Oh, hang on. Okay, no, this is new. It just looks exactly like the other place. Right, let's uh, activate. And we'll crack on. Okay, got more of these uh, divine divine creatures, eh? Ooh, you just shot me in the face with your with your face. It was quite easy. Okay, another ladder. Ooh, what's that up there? That's a fancy looking monolite. I'm probably not going to get there today. Although, actually, maybe we will. What are these? Ride the wind. Oh, it's going to teleport us, isn't it? Oh, no. We can float. Oh, that's cool. Oh, wow. Got some, some poison cores. Okay. I didn't know there'd be mechanics like that in this. That's pretty sweet. That's how we're going to get across here, I'm guessing. Okay. Um, there's another thing we can repair around here, it looks like. Yep. Okay, so we can't go that way. Ride the wind, bullseye. Does it last forever, or does it wear off eventually? Because I press, I press B there, or A, whichever one it is. No, it's B. Ah, silver ore, excellent. We might be able to upgrade our sword now. Our weapon? I shouldn't really say sword, because we upgrade our weapon, and that's the weapon we use for all of these classes. It just changes. Um, no, these are rougher. These aren't the enemies we're looking for. Soft cotton. More firelight fruits. Jolly good. Oh, I really... Are there any accessories that protect against poison? Have I got any? Can I buy some? That might be worth investing in. Because I get poisoned all the bloody time. Also, I am running a little bit low on... HP here. I appreciate it. Ah, there's we, there we go. There is we go. Blooms. Only one of them, though. Now we got we only got natural fiber from there. Oh, okay, right. It still counts though. It still counts. We just need to kill five of them. Nice and simple. It's not going to be floating across here. Is there anything before we do that round here? Nope. <clears throat> but yeah, I mean, ideally we want to head back. I mean, apparently you, you can wait till midnight and it, the screen will just start going black, so you don't need to be, you know, too careful. But I still, I'd, I'd rather not, you know, push my luck, so to speak. Right, I'm guessing these things do wear off eventually. Yeah, maybe maybe me pressing B had nothing to do with it. It was just luck, a coincidence. All right, go, go, go. Can we make it? Can we make it? Okay, there we go. Sweet. Yeah, we probably do have enough uh, materials now to upgrade our weapon. But again, I think I might hold off on that. I, I think I'm going to spend my money on, on a mount. Ooh, more wheat seeds. Jolly good. And perfect. Right, we've repaired the ladder. Okay, I think that's about all we're going to manage today. Feeling sleepy. So head back to our farm. And I think that was uh, that was pretty productive. 
Hopefully tomorrow we'll be able to get the rest of the resources for the guy, because I wouldn't mind getting that quest done as quickly as possible. Um, I've been told, actually, that I can sell the fur that I've been picking up. That's pretty much worthless, or not used in anything, so we can probably just sell that, which... Yeah, I wouldn't mind a little bit more money, because we are so close to being able to afford a mount. Um, also, I'm thinking I should probably... Uh, plant those wheat seeds if I can before the end of the day. Pop these things away though, don't need those. And we're going to do a lot of cooking tomorrow too. Definitely want to get some cooking done. Uh, right, pop you as well as well. Do I have any... I've got two pieces of fur. Earns you money when shipped. Yeah, okay. So, really should have read the description on those. That's fine, I'll quickly pop you in the box. Sell those. And get planting some wheat. Oh. Gonna have to re-hoe it. Ooh, it's getting, getting, getting late though. Nah, we should be fine, we should be fine. Plenty of time, no worries, no worries. That's all my seed, perfect. Okay, right. That's everything done. Let's head. I can't wait to see what that firelight fruit's gonna make drink-wise. Let's head back inside. Time to hit the hay. And yeah, I'm I'm guessing the fur's gonna make it probably not too much money. But then again, then again it's been quite rare. Oh, level 17. Okay, 100 a pop. That's actually not bad. Not bad. We're so close. So close to getting a mount. Day 21. All right, let's see. What have we got? Also, um... Morning. Morning. Let's do some cooking. I think I will make... Uh, I need more mushrooms. That's what I need. Also, I never did get some onion. Maybe I should buy some onion seeds. Are they, um... Can, uh, I'm, just, I'm just thinking, can I grow those in summer? Can I grow onions in summer? I hope so. Because if we, if we got a good bunch of onions, we could make a crap ton of vegetable salads, and they are so good. Just stats-wise across the board, absolutely stupendous. But for now, since we've not made a ketchup omelette, let's do that. Could actually make two if we wanted. Should we make two? Yeah, we might We might need the food for our next uh, expedition. <laughs> Get it? Because we're, we're exploring the, 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 the heaven's egg. Two ketchup omelettes. Uh, okay. Now, I don't... Yeah, I don't think we can actually deliver that one, though, can we? Uh, and you know what? Let's make some sandwiches too. Let's make a couple of sandwiches. Make sure we're fully stocked. Alright, let's go, go, go. I haven't, uh... No, not quite got enough for any of those yet. Oh, it's raining! Yes! Happy days, I don't need to water anything. Not that it takes very long, but I always forget, as you saw. Right. Uh, we've got some radishes for the first time. Very exciting. More tomatoes. And the wheat's growing nicely too. Grab our flour. I think I've not got enough wheat actually for some more flour. Firelight juice. Hang on a second. What is that like? Firelight juice. Where is it? Okay, that actually does look quite quite delicious. Uh, six, 600 HP ups fire damage. Okay, I mean that makes sense. It is explosive, so keep it away from fire. Hmm, not sure I'd be quite so uh, keen on drinking a very flammable... Then again, alcohol's flammable, isn't it? 
We all, we all drink alcohol and have no problem with it. I'm sure drinking bomb juice basically is fine. Maybe don't drink the pyro liquid though. That might be pushing it. Okay, good, good, good. Right, what can I pop in here? I could put a radish. We can make tomato juice. Let's pop in some tomato juice. All right, none of these are ready yet. Nope, straw buddy's still not ready. Okay. Something, something about the rain. Yeah, it just feels nice. Right, did we get any posts today? No posts today. Nobody loves me. All right, let's pop some stuff in storage. Uh, put the flour away. Yeah, I don't, I don't think I have enough wheats for another bag of flour yet, so... Put you away. Yeah, we got we got plenty of supplies. We're looking pretty good for another dungeon dive, so we'll do that today. See if we can find Tyella. Or at least make it through the next area. Because, yeah, I don't, don't quite have enough money yet for uh, my mount. Maybe I should do some fishing. Oh, I don't know. Now let's just have a whole day of dungeoning. Let's do it. Tyella needs us. Also, I should probably test out this new job as well. Which I will need to equip. So, probably replace the mage for now. I'm right near the bloody thing. I was literally, like, five steps away. Shadow Walker. I have to check the skills on that as well. Okay, so Crow of Night Tidings. What does that do? A mighty slash attack on surrounding enemies. Has higher attack power during break. Okay. Step. Um... Worm-eaten dew, that sounds gross. A slash and poison attack. Oh, yeah, we want to get that ASAP. That sounds like it'd be useful. Yep, yeah, okay, cool, cool, cool. We'll give this a go. <gasps> we look so cool. We got this outfit and everything. Oh, my God. Yes. Yes, right. Now, do I just run through here and fight some blooms? Or do we just... Now, nah, we'll, we'll go back to where we were. I'm sure we'll run into more of them anyway. Do, do. So, I really, really, really freaking love this game's atmosphere. It's got a fantastic... just feel to it. Also, I love that each job has a different kind of moveset. Like attack animation and everything. That is really cool. Right, so we can't repair that yet. It's pretty much... Uh, oh, hang on, I can climb the ladder, can't I? <clears throat> it's already alert. It's nearly noon already! I say, we lose a lot of time on the world map, don't we? So, the sooner we do get a mount, I think the better. Copper ore. Now, where actually am I going here? Uh, that is a good question, actually. That is a good question. Hang on a minute. Hang on a minute. I can go over there. That's what I do. Right. Yes. Please don't fail me now, magic wind. Thank you. Well, we've got a sparkly. How's our look today? Something shiny catches your eye. Try reaching inside the tank to get it. The cracked glass is dangerous. I'm probably going to take some HP damage here, aren't I? You reach inside the cracked culture tank and try to grab onto the item. As you do, you hear a crack and the glass suddenly shatters to the ground. Your arm gets cut. Your health decreased. But you managed to hold onto the item. It looks like a small wind core. Oh. Oh. Still haven't really used any of those yet, have I? Are they- did they- they're used in crafting, right? Yeah, used in crafting. So yeah, we we made the uh, arrow orb with that, didn't we? Which, to be fair, did do quite a bit of damage, so... 
see what uh, the skill looks like. Oh, you kind of teleport. Oh, that's so cool. That is very cool. Anything behind here? Nope. Now, I must be careful. Yeah, we've not actually eaten anything yet, so my stamina is going down. Maybe I should have a quick snack. Um, could munch on some pink aloe, maybe, but it's probably best to make that into juice. Um, see, I'm not injured enough, really, to want to eat yet, so I'm not going to bother. Not yet. We'll have an omelette soon. Uh, descend. Oh, that's a fear enemy. Oh. What level is it? It's level 30. No, we cannot defeat that one. You're very correct. But we might be able to take these things on. The battle begins. Whoa! Okay, that's really, really flashy. No, we're not really dealing a super amount of damage to these things with this job, but I just like the way it feels. It's good. Cotton. Hard skin. Well, it looks like we've found another... Oh, God. Are we going to have to... Really don't think we can tackle that just yet, game. It's coming right for us. This is not good. You turn around, please. Just want to see what this is over here. It's another one of these things. I need a, oh, I'll need a blue potion, won't I? And I bet it's gonna be I have a we around there. Let's climb up here first. Yeah, I'm gonna guess. Yeah, no, time to eat. Time to munch on an omelet. There we go. You guys are so good at killing stuff. Blue potion, perfect. Question is... What is around the corner? Let's, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Okay. What do we have here? Uh, do I destroy it? I do have a bomb. I might as well. Please be something good. Hermit's roots. Just one of them, really. Okay. Well, I turned one of those into juice, didn't I? Or did I? I can't remember. Have I used... I, I did have one, didn't I? Alright. This actually looks like it's leading to... Our little shortcut. Ow! That actually missed. I must have invincibility frames on the ladder. Right, there we go. So we can get back here much quicker now. Jolly good. Jolly good. I'm guessing this is actually the way we're supposed to go, is it? I do want to go back and try the blue potion, though. Uh, switch on the wall with lots of small holes around it. You don't know what the switch is for. Try pressing it. Oh, this is usually a... I mean, in video games, switches are usually there to be pressed, but... I don't know. There was that one switch in one of the Tomb Raiders, though. The old Tomb Raiders that you definitely don't want to press because it makes your life so much harder. But let's, um... Let's try pressing it. You press it and start to hear a faint noise coming from the holes. Looks like the switch was just there to turn on that noise. It gets louder by the minute, and I'm sure... Wow. I feel sick to the... St wow. I've got a debuff. Great. Bloody great. I don't know what that does. I don't know what that debuff does. Can I check in it uh, anyway what that does? Oh, meal effect minus 50%. Well, that's a crapper, isn't it? Ooh. I can get Blaze 2. Sweet. Uh, yeah, okay, cool. And 
Skylancer. Shorten job change cooldown. I think I was going to save up for Wind Nail, actually. Yeah, I was going to go for that one first. Actually, no. You know what? I kind of do want to enhance normal attack. So I think this works out cheaper. And we've unlocked our new panel! Beak Spike? Added combo to normal attack. Ooh. Piercing charge 2, increased physical damage. Oh yeah. Yeah, I do like the Skylancer job a lot. Probably going to keep that on the rotation for now. Right, I'm going to backtrack a little bit here. Oh, I'm losing track of where I've come from now. Um, I want to see what's through the blue area, but I feel like this way is where we're supposed to be going. I think. Might as well kill you guys, though. If I can bloody hit you. Oh, he's, he's really focused on them. <laughs> He did not care that I was smacking away at him. That is a very cool ability. More natural fiber, which means more bombs. Right, can we avoid... Oh, we killed another bloom, excellent. Can we avoid this fear thing? I think we just about can. Some plant is in the way, looks like you'll need something to remove it. I have just the thing. Potion caused the plant to wither without a trace. Uh, yeah, I, I was thinking it would just be some items, but what did we get? More radish seeds, only two. And one silver ore. Okay, I'm a little bit disappointed, not gonna lie. A little bit disappointed. Alright, just wait for him to come back this way. Seems to have a pretty predictable patrolling route. Okay. I think we might be able to just make it to the next monolite. There must be one close by. There must be. Well, then. Ho, 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 ho. I mean, boy, do we take a lot of damage still, though, man. I kind of wish we could equip armor, but I suppose we do have accessories that increase our defense. I do, I feel like we're, we're quite squishy. We need a few more levels. Right. Oh, hello. A leaf. I'm gathering a lot of materials today. Um, you're guarding something, aren't you? You're absolutely guarding something. What level are you? Level 16, not a problem. Alright, I've got his attention, guys. You hit him in the rear. You hit him in the rear. Is everyone all right? Jolly good. Jolly good. Strum more strawberry seeds. Although, I think we're running out of time this season to plant them. Well, no, we could probably still get some use out of them. Ooh. Yeah, no, we ain't, we, ain't, we ain't messing with you, buddy. Nope. Nope, nope, nope. Um, looks like we have another barrier here. Can we get through this? Do we need a bomb? Some plant is in the way. Looks like you need something to remove it. Oh, we just need another red potion, do we? Or something. Again, we're running out of time here a little bit. So, we might actually have to use... Yeah, we need a red potion. I just looked on the map. We might need to uh, use the old return bell. Is everyone all right? so I don't think I'm going to be able to run back to a monolite unless we find one. Hey, Connor Ludal! Right. How do I get up here? Really should drink something, shouldn't I? This is the potion. Not the red potion. Okay. There's stuff up there too. All right, let's just go. Let's just go. Let's get this open. All right. 
Next zone? Yes. And please be a monolite? Or, well, there's, there's going to be something happening here. Oh, don't tell me it's another. It won't be another boss, will it? This looks like a boss area, though. Oh. It's like we found some sort of research center. This is a cultivation pod, but it looks like it was abandoned a long, long time ago. What's a cultivation pod used for? For cultivating things. It's a vessel used to grow living things, or oftentimes create them from nothing. That's... that's mad scientist territory. Hold on just a moment. I already thought this place seemed suspicious, but you're telling me life was once created here? What is this place? Why do you know so much about it, Arya? Yeah, long story. Very, very long story. I'm glad we just get a nice little splash screen here. Fade to black. She is now all caught up. I must say, I find that all hard to believe. So let's pretend I never asked. It's none of my business anyway. I do like Estina. Ooh, that's glowing. There was something living in this pod until recently. Until pretty recently. What's wrong with that? Oh, nothing. Just caught my attention. But finding Taylor is our priority. I'm sorry, let's keep going. Hmm. Yeah, so they said Tyler turned up unconscious, no, like, memory at all. I bet this is where Tyler's actually from. I bet she was from this frickin' cultivation pod. Yeah, it's a frozen biosphere sample. Must have been their end product. Well, I'm glad you know what's going on, Arya, or you seem to know. Because I ain't got a clue. Right, there's nothing in here. Just a big old empty room. Looks like it. I would just really like a monolite, to be honest. And there we go. Right, so there's still a lot more to do, it seems. Uh, the V Wet Footprints Motus Monolite. So that's a name and a half. Really rolls off the tongue. Right, yeah, looks like there's still quite a bit to uh, work our way through. Since it is 9.20, we'll just have a quick dip our toes. We'll dip our toes in. Another ladder. Oh, what do we have here? Oh, we need a repair kit level 2. How do I make those? I don't know. Ah, Blooms, I need to kill you, please. Oh, that was some damage. That was some damage. Right, so we need to kill, what, two more of those? Uh, why am I glowing red? Is it because- I think it's because I'm nearly dead, isn't it? Uh, I do feel sleepy. Yeah, I think we'll probably... Probably call it a day. It is 10pm. Back to the monolite we go! But another very productive day. We've got through a good chunk of that dungeon. Turn home. Right, so, um, I don't think I, I have anything I can really sell. Well, I could sell a bunch of stuff and probably get enough money for a mount for tomorrow, but do I want to sell the stuff I have? That's the question. Really don't know if I do. Oh, we, well, we can sell the hard skin. Yeah, we'll definitely do that. Um,. I've got some seeds to plant, too, before we go to bed. Uh, I've got plenty of monolite fragments still, so I could just sell those, just for... gets and shiggles. And I might actually sell the wind core as well, because I do have plenty of those. Still. Got plenty of lumber, I'll save that. Yeah. 
Alright, let's plant those seeds. More straw buddies. Hopefully we'll get a couple of harvests out of them still. And radishes. Oh, let's pop you over... Over here on these random patches that have remained hoed. Okay, and I guess we still don't... Well, it's not raining anymore. I don't have to water them. It looks like they're all... Yeah, the ground's sodden anyway. Okay. Alright, we'll see if we get... Uh, some decent cash tomorrow. Oh, I really should have done some fishing. We can do that tomorrow. Yeah. Hmm. Unless anything happens tomorrow, I might kind of skip that day and just do some fishing. Just to get a little bit more money so we can buy a mount. For the next time we want to go across the world map, I might do that. Yeah. So we might skip a day, chaps. And I, I yeah, I'll probably just, just do some fishing. Ooh, level 18 though, very nice, and about halfway, okay. And since, ah, you know what, since we are, oh, we're so close. We're so close. Since we are level 18, I reckon it might be a good idea, maybe next video, to go back to the canyon and maybe try and fight one of the fear monsters for the first time, see if we get anything good. Because so I reckon we can take them on now. And if we make some bombs, we should be able to explore more of the canyon as well. But yeah, day 22, I think I'm probably just going to spend it doing a little bit of fishing. Uh, I don't think I can cook anything else right now, apart from another sandwich. Um, what do tacos need? Meat, tomatoes, and moricorn. Okay. Yeah, there's a lot of crops we haven't even bothered growing yet. Also because I just don't have the money to buy the seeds, or I do, but I'd rather I'd, for this time in the morning. I'd rather buy a mount, to be honest. Can I make another bomb? Yeah, let's make another bomb. In fact, let's make two. Let's make two bombs. Cause I'll be using those next time. Okay, right. No more of these done yet. Nope. And uh, we should have some crops to gather. Oh boy, do we. Any any posts today? No posts today. Oh, sad times. Alright. Just gonna grab all these. But yeah, I think we're gonna call it a day there, chaps. Thank you for watching. Next time, we'll probably have yeah, skipped this day and we'll head back to the Heaven's Egg. Maybe we'll explore the canyon as well. Also, you see the weird visuals on some of the crops when I pick some stuff up? Uh, tomato juice. Alright, let's pop in another tomato. And we got a bunch of straw buddies! Oh, dude! So many straw buddies. Now again, don't know if it's worth selling these or if we should just make them into juice and things. Yeah, right. I've got some watering to do, chaps. I'll do that off screen. Thank you for watching. Yeah, next time we will continue through the Heaven's Egg. It looks like I actually have some skill points to spend as well. Uh, might as well quickly do this before we leave. Get the step ability. And I think next one I'm going to go for is the poison. Yeah, that might be nice. No idea if any of the enemies are going to be weak to that. But anyway, I'm going to save. And uh, yeah, I'll see you next time where it will probably be the 23rd of spring. Yeah, unless anything weird happens, but I don't think it's going to. So uh, thanks for watching, everyone. I'll see you next time. Bye bye for now.